Welcome to the training session on finding journal articles in Science Direct. The contents of this training session is, what is Science Direct? Where do I find Science Direct? How do I effectively search for journal articles in Science Direct? And how do I cite journal articles in Science Direct? First of all, what is Science Direct? Science Direct is an online database that provides subscription-based access to peer-reviewed journals, articles, book chapters, and open access content that will help you to move your research forward. So where do you find Science Direct? If you go to the library website and click on online databases, you will, the next page will be the database page where you will find all the databases in alphabetical order. Once again, please remember to create your PIN. It is very important for off-campus access. And if you want to go to Science Direct, you click on S and it will show all the databases starting with S and then you click on Science Direct. How do I effectively search for journal articles in Science Direct? Once again, we will go back to the original research topic, the influence of occupational stress on quantity surveys performance. I chose as my main keywords, occupational stress and alternative keywords, uh, if you look at quantity surveyors, so this one can basically replace quantity surveyors, so I'm using that as alternative. You can also use phrase searching and the Boolean operators in conjunction with your keywords to formulate a search strategy. So once again, we will do a search now in Science Direct. So you go back to your library website, click on online databases, click on S, and click on Science Direct. Now you get to your home page of Science Direct. You can also create an account if you want to save searches. And then we will go to the advanced search option. On this page, you type in your keywords. And then also select from the article types. Review, review articles and research articles. Those two are very important to um, indicate in by ticking the boxes. And then you click on search. And then you will get your search results. Once again, you will see that at the top, you will see the search keywords that was used in your search. And you can also refine your search to make it more specific. If you want to use any of these, you can and it will update immediately. You can also view the abstract of the article. So if you click on abstract, you will be able to read the abstract. Or you can go to the full text article and download the full text article. Click on download PDF and then you will get to the full text article. You can also download multiple articles by ticking the boxes that you, that you want to download. And then you will see there's an indication of two articles that was um, indicated on the left-hand side, and those articles will be downloaded simultaneously. How do I cite journal articles in Science Direct? If you go back to your original uh, article, full text article, 
you will see at the top here, you will find all the bibliographic information that you need for your for your referencing. So the, the, the title of the journal and all the details there, and the title of the article and the authors. Um, and if you scroll down on this specific page to the bottom of the page, you will also get your your L address and that includes the DOI and you also need to write this down. So this is important also for your referencing. So let's go back to finding our, the reference style. So you click on the reference styles on the library website and you click on Harvard and then you type in, type in your login details, click on login and then you get all the bibliographic examples and you scroll down to journal articles and remember we had the DOI so you will take the one with DOI in the database so you click on that one there and then it will give you the exactly the example uh, the format of the example of the referencing example and then when you look at the components, you need to find each and every one of these components to be able to do your referencing example. And then you will also see an in-text reference example. And this concludes the training session on finding journal articles in ScienceDirect. Thank you very much.